Secretary of State Rex Tillerson will be in India later tonight in his first trip to the country since assuming his post. And this is the second high-profile visit to India by officials of the Trump administration in a month following Defence Secretary James Mattis's trip to New Delhi in September. Our India correspondent Neha Punia reports on what India expects from this visit. This is Rex Tillerson's first visit to India since the Trump administration took charge in the United States and the focus is going to be on what India can do for the US in terms of stabilizing Afghanistan and maintaining a, a sense of order in the Indo-Pacific region to counter China. Secretary Tillerson indicated as much in a speech he made a few days prior to his India visit. China, while rising alongside India, has done so less responsibly at times undermining the international rules-based order. Even as countries like India operate within a framework that protects other nations' sovereignty. While India has welcomed America's positive evaluation of Indo-US ties, New Delhi has chosen to not comment on its criticism of China. Experts say while India is keen to play a bigger role geopolitically in this region, it doesn't want to do so at the expense of being pitched as China's rival. Quite recently, India and China were engaged in a 10-week-long border standoff, after which both sides have stressed on the need for better diplomatic ties. Many in India also warn against what they see as a transactional nature of the Trump administration. They say India must first see what is the U.S.'s uh, meaning when it says it wants a more substantive role for India in the region when it comes to its South Asian policy. India will also closely be watching how the Trump administration tackles its own ties with uh, Pakistan and China and then take cues from that. As far as Afghanistan is concerned, India has also made it very clear it's not going to be sending troops on the ground. But Prime Minister Modi's government is committed uh, to uh, enhancing and working alongside the United States uh, to strengthen the security framework in Kabul. For example, continuing its defense and uh, development cooperation with the Afghan government. Now, during this visit, India is also keen on raising uh, issues that matter to its own domestic constituency. So the threat of cross-border terrorism emanating from Pakistan, uh, barriers to Indo-US trade, and the curbs on the H-1B visa regime are all going to be high on India's agenda. Neha Punia, Channel News Asia, New Delhi.